Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Code for Kids. So this is our app development model, okay? So today we, are, we will develop one application, which is your mobile application. So let's start our today's class. So till that, what you can do, you can like, share and subscribe our channel also and press the bell icon if you want more latest update, okay? So now, uh, first we will search for the tag table and even you can access our playlist. In that you will get all the videos, okay? So you need to just search for thumb cable. After that, you have to just click on start today. And then over here, you have to first log in. First, you will click on log in button. So you have to just, it will show you some option whether you want to log in with your Gmail, email, or like uh, your Apple. So whatever you want, you can select. After that, you will also get the same screen. Over here, we will click on create new app. You have to write your project name, whatever project name you want. Suppose I want image recognition. So today's project is image recognition. So what will happen here? Once you will run this project, it will first capture the image, okay? It will open the camera, it will capture your image, and based on that image, it will predict something. Okay, so here in the category, you can select any category. If you want, you can select one or more than one. You have to uncheck this why because if you want more development area, if you want more drag and drop features, so you need to just select the, uncheck that, click on create button. So now it will create one new project for you, okay? So here uh, we have uh, two things. In our previous video also I told you, first you have to design and based on your design, you will add some instruction, you will add some blocks, okay? Suppose if I want my background color as in red or whatever is your favorite color, you can select. Suppose I want this color, okay? After that, what I want, like a, when I click on the button, so camera will open, that will take a picture and an image recognizer will recognize about that image, okay? So how we will design this? So as you can see, this is add component window here. First, we want to add one label. Here we can write image, means, you can write your project name, okay? After that, see if we have one label. After that, suppose if we want our prediction and confidence label, so you can just click on this label, rename this. You can write prediction, okay? Then again, we will take one more label. So for this label, we have to rename as confidence, okay? And uh, we will remove the label here, a word, okay? After that, we want one image, like uh, you need to just search for image, you will get that right and drop. See, from here also, you can rearrange this, okay? Then we want to add one button, like when you click on the button, so what will happen? It will capture my photo. So for button, we can write click. Even if you want, you can change a background color also for your button is. Whatever designing you want, you can do. And we have to add our image recognizer, which will recognize about your image. See? You need to just drag and drop. So you will get your image recognizer. After that, we want camera also. Why? Because we want to capture the photo. So you have to just drag and drop your camera also. So as you can see, total we have six component. One button, which is click me, two label. First one is a prediction, second one is a confidence. We have one image, we have camera, we have image recognizer. So 
This is all about your designing. Now, how you will add your coding part? So, as you can see, we have a two thing. We have design, we have a blocks. So, once you will click on the block, so what we want? First thing we want, like we need to click on the button. So, where is my button? If you will see, this is your button. Click on that and drag and drop this. When button is clicked, so when button is clicked, what is first thing we want? We want to open the camera. So what will happen? It will open your camera. What will happen here? Camera will capture the photo. Okay. So once your camera will capture the photo, that photo we want to set to our image. So you have to just click on image, set image picture. And whatever the camera will capture the photo, we will set that photo here. Understood? Means when you will click on the button, camera will take the photo and that photo we will store inside our image. Now, after that, what will happen? Now we will call our image recognizer. Okay. So what will happen? This image recognizer will recognize about your image. Okay, what will happen? This image recognizer will recognize about image. So if the image recognizer will recognize your image, so first we want that photo, right? So where you will get that photo, this photo we will pass here. Okay, so once the cap image recognizer will recognize about that image. After that, we have to just set our confidence and uh, we have to set our prediction. You need to just click on prediction and we have to put it here. But as you can see, this is just a black value. So for confidence, you have to take your confidence level. For prediction, you have to take your description. Okay, now see what is logic here. When you will click on the button, camera will open, the camera will take the photo. That photo first we will save to our image. Okay, and now we will call our image recognizer. What will happen? Here you have to pass this photo because once the image recognizer will get the image, that only that will recognize about that, okay? Then we have to label confidence and prediction. So in this two label, we have to just set our confidence and prediction, okay? Now, how you will test this project? So as you can see here, we have life test pattern. So you need to just click on your life test. And once you will click on that, you are able to run your project, okay? See, if I will click on click me, what will happen? My camera will open, it will take my photo, okay? Just see. So here you have to allow. See, okay, this is my image now. It will recognize about something like Radha Vishwanath wearing glasses. Even you can recognize uh, with a different thing. Like uh, suppose now I will recognize with phone. Okay. See. See. And talking on a cell phone. Okay. So that will recognize something about your image. So like that you can just try with your like uh, some toys some dolls and some suppose if you have Doraemon, you can just recognize with that okay now see using a cell phone so uh, it is not recognizing the hundred percent but you will get a result at least like a 70 to 80 percent it is showing you the correct result, okay? So in this way, you can use your image recognizer, you can use your camera, okay? So in the design, you have to just take your button, two labels and one image. After that, you have to take two more component, which is camera and uh, image recognizer. And then you will add this block. 
So in this way, we can create our image recognizer project, okay? So thank you so much for watching this video. And please like, share and subscribe our channel, which is Code for Kids, okay? And press the bell icon also if you want more latest updates. So thank you so much.